Good morning. Another beautiful day. Been putting some sevens dust and some of this uh, fungicide stuff on my roses. They're doing a little bit better now that I've started trimming them and stuff. So hopefully they will start picking up some. There's a little rose I planted the other day. Looks like it's doing pretty good right there. And here's my bed out here that I've been working on. Everything seems to be doing pretty good except the um, sweet potato vine for some reason. It's just not, I mean it's growing, but it doesn't look all that great out here. Maybe it doesn't like the full sun. Of course that purple heart's doing great. My mom's look like they're going to bloom again. There's our little baskets that Tammy wants out here. Vinca, doing fantastic. It always does so good. Lantana, the stuff that I just planted last week. The Dianthus, it'll take it a little while to get going, but it'll be fine out here. There's those wildflowers, I don't know what they are. But they're growing. And I haven't shown you guys my hosta before. This is one spot I need to split this up for sure this year. It's so thick, and i got tons of places I can put this hosta. I don't think I've shown you guys my oak leaf hydrangea. That's a beautiful plant if you haven't seen that before. Blooms about off of it there. But it is a really nice plant. I got it next to some yellow bell here. I'm getting ready to do some serious surgery on this thing right here. These yellow bells, you got to really hack them down about once a year. I have some over there too. <clears throat> I really like yellow bells. I know they don't bloom very long. My wife don't like them that much though. But I think they're pretty. And my blackberries. Showed them to you. I think last week. And we got a couple of berries here. They're getting ready to turn red and turn black if I can keep the birds out of them. Won't be long. There's my blueberry I planted last week. Coming along well, right here next to my garden. I've added some straw after watching some YouTube to my garden. Got a few things going here. I think that is a zucchini. It's not. It's it's doing okay. Huh? My squash. I've got plenty of these late, but I'm starting to get some blooms on them. It'll be long. My okra is doing much better. After I started spraying it with the um, sevens, the leaves are nowhere near as they up. And I went through and I picked out all the ones that were paired together so that they are uh, thriving a lot better. Got some uh, cantaloupe down here. I'm going to let it run. Uh, let it run along down through there. And my bell peppers are starting to get starting to get some peppers on them. There's that one. That one's got a little one on it. Oh, look at this one. One couple going there. So they're doing okay. My tulip tree is about to bloom again. For some reason weird looks pretty though the blooms on these are so pretty my strawberries on my new bed I made the other day seem to be doing just fine I think they'll do good there like I said plenty of sun bell peppers, I mean bell peppers, jalapeno peppers, coming along just fine out here on the porch, look nice and healthy, I'm really happy with these Vivisun bags here, everything seems to be thriving in them, oh, my tomatoes, starting to get some 
that is all. I think these are my Rutgers right here. And I don't remember what the names of these are. You guys can help me out with that. But they're doing very well right here. Today I believe it's the 10th of June. Now I moved all of my uh, herbs over here to this side. They were over there, but that side gets the hot sun, the evening sun, and they were getting, you know, they were drooping and stuff. So now that they're over here, they haven't drooped at all. They don't dry out. I think I've figured that out within my sage. I had to go back and cut a lot of it. It was really looking rough, but now you can see it's getting some new growth in it. So apparently I did that right. I mean my basil, not my my basil, not my sage. But anyway, this stuff's doing very well. And there's my little cypress tree I want to take down there and see if I can figure out a place to put it in Florida. I'm getting ready to go down to Florida and fish for about three or four days. I got to get my boat out of the shop down there in Pensacola. So I'm going to be gone. I moved that from up front. It started looking a little rough on that front porch and these are doing so well. These begonias and stuff back here I thought I would move them. And then everything else is doing well back here. Soda, you doing okay? She's doing good. And you can see her little planter right there with the wildflowers in the middle. So I'm going to be gone for about three or four days. So we'll see what this looks like when I come back. Hopefully, I hope everything won't be dead. Maybe we'll get a little rain while I'm gone. <sighs> Beautiful day. Nichols Retirement Empire. So, Soda likes it too.